What is good, y'all? You dig what I'm saying? And welcome back to yet again another episode of JI Productions. As you guys can see in the title and the thumbnail, today is the day we are finally, 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 finally installing the floor for the trunk setup. I'm super stoked. I'm super hyped for you guys to see it because I'm telling you, it's one of one. You will never, ever, ever, ever have seen anything like this for a trunk setup, yet alone for any car, but yet alone a Camaro, you feel me? Like, I'm telling y'all. So without further ado, we're gonna go ahead and roll that intro and get straight into this video, baby. Let's get it. What is good, y'all? You dig? Welcome back to yet again, another episode of J.I. Productions. It's your boy, J.I. Make sure you smash that subscribe button. Enjoy the video, you dig? Shit. Yeah, oh my man. god. I need you to put some weight on here. Yeah. Like just bags. Alright, y'all. Just a quick little update. Sorry about the music type copyright. Gotta talk fast. So we're gonna drill a hole right here for the airline. And drill another hole right here for the water trap line. And then we're gonna mount the compressor here underneath the wood. That way it'll be clean, smooth, and flush. You won't even be able to see it. So we're getting there. Yeah, sir, so we just pulled up to O'Reilly's so and grab some, you know, extra parts and shit like that. And then head back to go ahead and work on mine, but goddamn. So, we got about five foot of the airline. My boy D West is pulling up. He got the airline cutter. So, we should be straight. And then, bro said he wasn't pulling back up until about an hour to cut the. Can't say what it is yet. Y'all ain't seen it yet. But to cut the uh, floor and have so we'll be able to get it inside the trunk. So, while we wait for him to pull back up, we're gonna try to knock out everything else.
All right, y'all. So as y'all can see, Mamba is back outside. You feel me? Got my nigga Mel. Got my nigga D-West. All my niggas help me out with this hoe. Feel me? Look at this shit. Stop playing with me, bro. Stop playing with me, bro. Who you know? Y'all niggas doing wood floors and shit. That's cool. That's cute. You know what I'm saying? That's cute. You feel me? But who you know got marble that master paint, nigga? Who you know? With the fucking tank floating on the door like that, nigga. Stop Where playing with me, bro. At? Where the compressor at? Good, good question, man. Damn, so it's just running like I, I got to blow in that bitch type for the thing to just fill big, up tight. Big, big stealth shit. You stop playing with me, bro. Bags and a full trunk. Look, <laughs> on moms, if you haven't already, bro, get this video a big thumbs up. Shout out to all my niggas. All their Instagrams is in the description down below. Y'all make sure y'all go follow them, bro. No cap. Nigga, stop playing with me, hey, bro. Don't get it twisted. We use these cars too. You feel me, bro? Stop playing with me, bro. <laughs> like, bro, stop playing with me, bro. Type visionary with it, bro. That shit looks so clean. <laughs> bro, stop playing with me. God damn, I'm trying to tell y'all, bro. Talk to him, man. Talk to hey, him, man. Ben done told us about this shit, bro. But, hey. <laughs> oh, man. Visionary, brother. It's Visionary in the head. Right here, bro. We just put it out in the fucking uh, real life for him. No Fit. cap, bro. Come on, man. With the carbon yeah. fiber on the door handles, bro. What is good, y'all? You do what I'm saying. So I decided I need to come on here real quick. Um, because that outro, I was really just hype as hell and that the floor was done. Um. And so I ain't really close out the video how I normally do. I kind of skipped the J High Squad shout out. And it's a couple people that I need to thank real quick. Um, so let's go ahead and get straight into this. I really, really, really need to thank my boy, Root Beer Folk, Kashik. You dig what I'm saying? I really appreciate you, folk. We spitballed this idea. Uh, I want to say a couple months ago, and we finally, finally after, you know, going back and forth and trial and error and stuff like that, finally got it done, and it looks amazing, so a huge shout out to you, bro. Then, I need to shout out my boy, Mel, what bags? Huge shout out to you, folks, you know what I'm saying, always coming through in the clutch. Um, whenever we needed something or whatever. Um, so I really appreciate you, folk. Then, my boy Balu. Huge shout out to you, too, folk, because, you know what I mean? If it wasn't for you, we wouldn't have the shop. We wouldn't be able to work there, type, you know, and work on the car after hours and shit like that, and just spitballing ideas and stuff like that. So I appreciate you, too, buddy. Then, D West, I appreciate you, homie. Because if it wasn't for you, you know what I mean, we wouldn't have been able to get the airline to fit because for some reason, I don't have an airline cutter, even though they come with all airlift kits. Um, that's interesting, you feel me? But we're gonna, I'm going to deal with that later. And then, last but not least, my boy John. I really appreciate you too, folk, because if it wasn't for you, we wouldn't have been able to get the floor inside the trunk to begin with because we needed, as you guys seen in the clip, he didn't want to be on camera, and y'all already know how I am, bro. I'm very respectful. I ask people before I start recording and stuff like that because I know not a lot of people want to be on film, but we was inside of his shop using his tool to cut the, um, cut the floor to be able to put it inside the trunk, like legit. We had the floor done, we had the compressor done. Everything was done and ready to go, except for the floor being cut. We had to cut the floor to get it in. So if it wasn't for you, bro, like that floor wouldn't, would still be at the shop right now. Um, and we would have been looking for a second option to try to get it cut. So huge shout out to you. Huge shout out to all my people who pitched in and helped out um, getting this vision that I had in my head done and made into real life and put into the car man this is legit one of one i know for without a shadow of doubt in my freaking being that there is no camaro on bags with marble floor in the trunk you feel me y'all can correct me if i'm wrong in the comments down below but i know without a shadow of doubt you feel me without a shadow of doubt ain't no camaro like that you feel me 
Um, and then finally, bro, finally, 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 I got to go ahead and give the J.I. Squad shout out of the day. Now, with all of that being said, that's going to be it for this video. If you're new to the channel, we just hit 2,100 subscribers. If you're new to the channel and you haven't subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Turn on those post notifications because the next install that's coming pretty soon is them bad boys over there. So, make sure you subscribe. Make sure you drop your comments in the comment sections and tag your ads. And give this video a big thumbs up. Share this video, bro. Share it. You feel me? Because... Everybody needs to see this. This is crazy. You feel me? Like, who do you know got marble floor in their trunk, bro? You feel me? Now that I, now when I start racing dudes after I add all the boat times and stuff like that, if you take an L, bro, you got to mop my trunk. No cap. But I'm going to see y'all in the next one. Peace.